Scrabble here. Last time we ended up finishing the Devourer fight in Eterna Noctis. Ended up on the path of the Emperor just for a quick save point, and this time we carry on in our journey. We'll do a quick little look here, and as we showed last time, we move on this way. Yeah, we're probably missing some stuff, almost definitely, but we're going to keep moving along here. I did not record this one immediately after. This is days later. Oh, let's do this little talk here. My very young apprentice, the sword will be yours if you bring the hilt and defeat the butcher if you desire the blood shirk. And you must first test your agility, bring one of the hidden bells from the Temple of the Clouds. Wait, did I do that conversation last time? Why do I feel like I did not? That was a strange conversation, though. Continue. All right. Onwards. And upwards. Yeah, we definitely didn't. There's there's no way we get this here. The lightning that fuels the queen's soul. Chaos did well to limit the power of such a powerful energy flow. Otherwise, the Tower of Light would shatter with each new discharge. At the top is one of my fragments of power. It is time to get it back. And we get to see what's going on in here. As you can see, we move through. We also kind of move through with the... Uh, same indication what we had previously and you can see the same momentum you can see everything building up around us you do not want to get stuck in that we're just going to go over here see how long it takes to build and where it stops i feel like as we get higher it gets closer to the sides oh maybe there's just actually close to the sides That's where you can see that the... Ah, right, I did have that. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> and I don't know where all the stuff is hidden in here. So, just so you know, it's possible that we're missing the stuff along the way. Like, right there. Oof. That's not great. Uh, that is not going to fly for us, is it? Oh my god. I'm going to have to go down. Uh, that's literally quite bad for me. And I'm dead. That's the first death. You can see we start over quite nicely, though. I feel like if we had double jump, this would not be that bad. But we go over here, go like that. Maybe we do have to go over. There we go, just tap in a few times. The platforming in this game is, like I said before, kind of like the fun challenge. Ah, there we go. That explains so much. I'm just gonna wait here a sec. I don't have any blood, so I can't show you our blood ability. I'm not a big fan of the blob enemies. The Originally, they're fine. Oh, right, this one. Just wait a sec. There we go, grab some blood. Originally they're fine, but then they like to go big. And later on, I guess maybe not right now, they explode. And when they explode... Nope, thank you. There we go. When they explode, they usually do, like, attacky things. Like, they might do that. See, they fire light blasts out, and I actually do not want to get hit by those light blasts. That's a little more dangerous than I want. Get that. I don't think so, bud. Ah! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Get over to the side, please, and thank you. I 
don't want to get trapped. I don't know what it's uh, what the range is on this guy. It's funny, I actually really like this level a lot. I've played through it a couple times. And look at glue. We get a chest. I'll take it. Woo. Uh, let's go this way. There we go. And bounce up and up. Uh, we do not want to be stuck on. Uh, crap. Where's this go? No! Oof, there we go. Alright, we're gonna pop in here. Whew! Then, how do I use my healing? Uh, let's see here. That's like a charge. That looked like he used some blood. Oh, it's Map Guy! I totally missed him. How can I help you, King of Darkness? Uh, so region map we definitely want. 750 dogmas, thanks. Oh, am I hitting the wrong button? Oh, I can barely see. I can barely see the... Uh, buy and cancel. Uh, I got 13,000, so not enough for that. And these other things I just don't care enough about. Okay. In the side rooms, we do not have to worry. Ah, what's the... There we go. Okay, it's hold down on the D-pad. I don't want to lose the blood. And I want the heal. In these side rooms, we do not have to worry about the sword. The sword of light cannot get us with its giant explosions. And, well, we can't get everything over here, like that, that uh, soul mirror piece at the moment. I think there's something over here we can grab. Whoa! There we go. All right, come on, buddy. Oh, he got me. Like I said before, I'm not a big fan of this guy. There we go. Oh, he didn't explode. Let those bounce. Grab that. Oh, a gem slot! Well, that actually seems incredibly valuable. We're gonna take it for sure. Do not get hit. It's very important not to get hit by that crap. And there's nothing over there, which is my other thought. So, onwards! Back to the main room. Like I said before, we can't get that right now. But a gem slot is very valuable. I don't think we have two gems, but still valuable. There we go. Uh, sure, we go that way. There's a way to the right and a way up, so let's go to the right first. I don't think there is anything for us in here, right? So, uh, yeah, we have none left. And gems, we only have the one slot. It's equipped. We have an empty second slot. And as you can see, it marks question marks on the map, but I don't think we need to get any of those right now. 
Onward and upward. It'd be really cool if I got to the top of this tower and ended the video there. Like, this tower is just huge. But the platforming is nice. Uh, I'm gonna head down that way. Oh, first thing I'm gonna go up. And I see this black portal, I believe, means that at the bottom, there's a portal, and it's gonna pop there. I don't know how long this is gonna take. I also don't know how long this effect takes. I was gonna say, now I think I had enough time. Definitely think I had enough time. You hear anything? I am drinking a peach Cottage Springs Vodka Soda. Quite good. It's become my drink of choice. There we go. And ta-da! We got that soul mirror piece. Great. And eventually we'll get back to it. up, so I'm actually going to take it a little easy right now. Oof. Maybe. I can't. Ah. Whoa. Ha! I flew too close to the sun, friends. I think you can make that jump. Certainly later when you get another jump, you can do it, but I thought I'd be able to get that jump right now. Oh, God. Come on, don't kill me. I know I mentioned that the platforming is challenging in this game. And I meant it. Certainly for a scrub like me. Speedruns in this game would definitely be fun to watch because the platforming is so cool. Um, I see what I'm supposed to do. I just don't know if I have time to do it. Oh god. Oh god. Get me over there. There we go. Good. Restart point nice and close. I thought maybe it would continue while I was in there. But no. All right, continue on our way. Huh. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Said we start, we start over nice and good. Right there. Oh, God. thing was supposed to take us, but I think, I don't know if I can do it now. Oh, I can't. I was like, I think, oh, now I can. Shoot. All the way back. Do you remember when I said I was a scrub? Oh my god. Hopefully this points out that I wasn't joking. God. Oh! Oh my god, I had a shortcut the whole time. Man, you reveal yourself a shortcut and you have no idea. That's like the scrubbiest. Ah! And that kills me, right? Yeah. I gotta go kill that guy. At least, now... 
very aware when I have a shortcut. Nice. And why don't we check this one out? So this should give us access to mission number two. Go. I don't even know if I have to jump. I just don't want to lose. There we go. There we go. I like it when they're like, you've already lost. Oh my god, platinum status. Oh, come on! Right, I gotta catch. You have to catch there. Oh, well. Yeah. They're like, no, oh, you're bronze. That means the end has to be, like, super close to this. I feel like I was doing not too bad until I hit this section. There we go, I managed to get a bronze. Look at that. That puts me at 314 on the list. Well, that's not too bad. Unfortunately, I feel like there is nothing great. Uh, CD arrows. I'm not sure what an arrow CD is. It looks like I was going to get... Oh, cooldown. Your arrow cooldown was too, but they don't give you any arrows. Why do you have an arrow cooldown? It doesn't make sense. Wall clinging, you get jumps, your dash cooldown is a fourth of a second. Uh, yeah, we're gonna grab that, please. We're gonna pop up here. That's not where I expected to go at all. A little bit of cursing. Oh, we want to move over now. Grabbing it. You can also see that my my uh, blood meter is shattered when I die. Saying you're kind of screwed at the moment, bud. There you go. Okay. Fuck. Ah. Ah. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die again. Oh, come on! And I'm definitely gonna die for that. Oh, this game. This game. And I feel like that's not even a section where I need to go. That it's just a fragment of the soul mirror. Oh, come on. 
They're like, that's too close. Oh, God. Ah, oh, a little too high. My dash wasn't working. Uh, we're gonna try that again, though. See, and it's also hard because you're on, as I showed there, a time limit. Oh, God. I feel like this is the point where everyone's like, you know, the game was looking pretty good, but now it's not for me. But do remember, this is what they call hard mode. It's also the mode to keep in mind that the game released with. So it kind of was the intended difficulty. Until folks were like, you know, this is a little too hard. Uh, this is not great for me. We're gonna move over here. Alright, keep it going, keep it going, we can do it. I used to play Gungeon on the channel. I'm kinda also interested in getting back to a rogue-like let me know if that's something you're interested in seeing. Uh, yep, we'll take that. Thank you very much. Oh, oh man, ping me just perfectly. dead in about two seconds, you know? I don't want to be dead in two seconds. Oh, God. Uh, and that's I turn in Noctis, folks. It's just kind of how it goes. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, frig. And back to the start. And I'm just gonna move over poorly. Just let it die. Uh, I think, okay, good. I was like, I think I'm dead right here. But I don't. It's just out of range. It'd be kind of cool if I killed the enemies, right? I mean, not the ones that I have to jump off of, because that would be just extra hell, but. Oh, well, shit. Ugh. That one. Got me. Don't kill me, okay? I'm so close here to another room. For a second, I was like, oh no, I just walked into that room. There we go. Oh, and I hit a, I hit, I hit a checkpoint pole, which is excellent. Uh, I think, yeah, both sides here go up, but let me just check the other side and make sure that there's no... Uh, no, it's just literally the other side. It's just, you just want to make sure that you weren't in the middle of something. 
There we go. We're in the upper section, they call it. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it so much. It sounds like it breaks me, but it doesn't. I just... Oh. The game is so trolly. I also have uh, started trying to play some Mario Kaizo. Which, I mean, makes sense when you take a look at this. There we go. Hello. Oh, God. Jump, jump, jump. Frick. Oh, God. Jump, jump, jump. Oh. Yes, I blew up here, but that looks like a gem. It also looks like I have to fall on it. Oh, I hate that guy. That is a gem. Oh, I hate that guy. Not, not my favorite dude, I'm gonna be honest. When I say, I hate that guy, I mean, I've had better dudes. I may not have had better dudes, but there are preferable dudes for me to fight in this game, thanks. And we're gonna stay here, because that's gonna blow up. I'm excited to equip our next gem. Glad we got it. Come on, get back here. Get back here. There we go. Hello. All right, do we want to go up? I think we do just want to go up. There's always stuff to the sides, but you can always come back and get it later. Ah! I wanted to get out of the way. I promise I did. Back down. Jump over to here, and here, and up. And... Bounce. And nail that guy. Oh, I was like, I just got hit by him, didn't I? And I did. chest up there. Um, unfortunately, I think I have to go down. Yeah. That's actually incredibly tough to see where you are with the effect going on. Okay. Uh, pop over here. Reasonably comfortable landing on the sides of these things, but if you're not, this side will be tricky. There you go. I'll take it. I'll take every checkpoint. Thank you. There's another chest. Oh, God. Another chest there. Uh huh. Thank you. Oh, and there's a way this way. Let's see what it is. Oh, we cannot go that way. This is like a like a dark barrier here that we cannot cross. I'm gonna use the skill point. They're not skill point. I'm gonna use the uh, healing potion though. Ah! That was not great. Okay. Is 
There we go. Whew. Another rough one. Yeah, we're gonna just grab this. Perfect. Oh, I tried to get out. Ah! No, I don't think so. Thank you, sir. Oh god, that's rough. Nope, I gotta wait. I gotta wait! Eh, I gotta wait. Eh, I gotta wait. <laughs> oh, I wanna tempt it. Boy, these enemies get in the way, don't they? Oh god. Just the fact that this guy becomes invincible is the pain in the butt. Um, what am I doing here? Oh, okay, that shoots me up. Oh, a health potion. I will take it. I like those. Uh, there is a checkpoint right there, which I'll take. I guess I could have gone this way before. I just don't want to have to do that bottom section again. Like I said before, the game is very liberal with the checkpoints. Oh, God. That was poorly timed. Another checkpoint. I could have just went that way last time. Oh, no, not that way. Uh, okay, that was fine. I was like, oh no, I'm dead. And sometimes I do feel like there are moves where you can jump off of, like, enemies and stuff nicely. Hello. Uh, the light crystal absorbs the energy from the cradle, powers the tower, and, of course, the sword protecting the soul of its eternal owner. I thought it would be luckier this time, and it would not be around. No one said this was easy. Uh, okay. All right. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, shoot, how do I get over there? Uh-huh. Oh, God. I was like, I'm missing something. I still feel like I'm missing something. Ah! Shoot! Okay, so I can hop down through these ones. I love the music here, by the way. Uh-oh. I feel like this is not as hard as I am making it look. Not even close. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Kind of unfortunate. Oh, 
I could just land. I didn't realize I could just land there. Remember when I said we are happy that they are generous with checkpoints? Like, this is one of the things we were talking about. Okay, out of focus, guys. Jump, 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 jump. Checkpoint, just jump. Go and go. Go and go! Jump and jump. Oh god. Jump, 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 go. Fall. And I know I I like see the moves. There you go. Off to the side. Perfect. I see the moves. I'm just not making the moves. And then we get these nice little spots that are clear of bad guys, which is fun. Right? It's nice they give you a break. Oh god. Oh, see how that's totally sealed with light? You can't go that way. I'm gonna press up. Use my health potion. The size of the guy changes how many blasts come out. Oh god, I could have just popped up. That's the worst. Where you're like, ah, oh, I just didn't have to move to the side and it would have been okay. Oh god. Just when you miss slightly. Not a good feeling. Everything is pretty precise. Okay, just don't jump. Good lord! Oh, shoot. Sometimes the bloom effects you don't even notice when there's damage elements. Like there. Twice. Now I see it. Got 
Oh god, I had to wait there. I felt like I had a micro stutter. Speed of light here. Look at him fly. Love the animation. So good. We made it to the top. Right here. Okay. Now we just have to smash five gems and we're good. And I don't remember his moveset. Oh, right. And the bosses in this game last longer than you would anticipate. There we go. Fortunately, just one hit, though. Oh, that is a hard move to time for me specifically. Right, that one, that one is my worst move for handling for him. I always remember that. Smash. And we are going to use the healing. Oh. This one's actually reasonably easy to dodge. I wish they were all that one. Because this crap gets hard to. Alright, well I'm gonna try a couple more times and then I will leave and uh, do this another time. So I have things I need to do tonight still. the spinning and these light beams, which is not too bad. And again, the graphical effects are super cool. I like those quite a bit. Ah! It's random, so it's not like I have to deal with the one in the corners all the time. Because it's totally random. I'm going to stay in the middle over here. That's about where it comes. If I was faster, this would pose less of a threat. Alright, be nice to me. Nope, not nice to me. Whoa. Ah! No! Oh my gosh! So mean, I hate that one. I absolutely hate it. Ah! Oh, I got a health potion. This one I can deal with. Oh god. Still deal with it. All right. Another health potion be nice. Nope, no health. Get one of these though. Be nice. This is 
reasonably nice. Sometimes I get hit here, but it's not too bad. Oh god. Once the twist stops, that's what gets me. Got him. There we go. Whew. Oh, what a perfect time to stop. 45 minutes, under an hour. Teach us. Defeat the sword in the light tower. Reach the top of the light tower. And we walk in here. Time is the canvas. And my hand is the brush. The cycles of light and darkness followed one another. And continued their reign over Aeterna in chaotic harmony. The eternal cycle of night and day. Battle by battle. Life and death. At the peak of the battle, with the queen kneeling before the king awaiting the killing blow, she glimpsed a shadow of doubt in his eyes. She gathered the little light she had left, snatched up the sword at her feet, and in one first swoop, penetrated the body of her nemesis, who faded away under her impassive stare. She was astonished she did not feel euphoria. Instead, a strange sadness gripped her soul, as if a longing older than time itself had awoken inside her. The years became centuries, and the king never returned. Equilibrium had been destroyed, and the world became submerged in an era of unparalleled light, whilst in the tormented soul of the queen, a question resounded with a thunderous echo. What was that shadow of doubt I saw in the king's eyes? She was confused, and since the king would not be keeping his date with destiny, she decided to embark upon the search for an answer. Alone against all opposition, she began her journey to an uncertain destiny. She entered the depths of Aeterna, reaching the doors of the Abyss. She unsheathed her sword, ready for battle. And to her surprise, the doors opened. Inside, terrible beasts made way for her to pass. At the end of the dark path was the cradle of the soul of the cursed king. Inside, the fallen monarch was seated on his throne, impassive. Life after life. Life after life. The eternal cycle of night and day. Glance after glance, their souls crossed, and she suddenly understood everything. She had always known the answer deep inside but had never accepted it. Their rivalry through the cycles of war had given way to something more intense and pure. Light and darkness, once eternally at war, united and created a new, living, ethereal being. Neither night nor day, neither light nor darkness. It was the Grey Soul. But like I said before, I haven't gotten to the most difficult portions of this game, so I don't know what the Grey Soul is. At last, the first of the fragments. And the Queen's soul is still chained by chaos, just like mine. Some things will never change for now. We get the Shrine Fragment, that's the first of seven. We're gonna walk into the save here. Oh, 
the celestial companion. I can use this energy to shoot light arrows and instruments created by the Kodan. They serve as ranged weapons to activate targets, so I can shoot them holding down and replacing Y and direct the shot with the left stick. Besides, if while holding Y, I also press B, I will get stuck. You will be able to direct the shot without moving. This power is so pure, it will allow me to improve my arrow skills without limit. Alright, Y. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh, I missed. Oh. The arrows are one of the things that make this game very special. And the more you see from the arrows, the more you will realize how they make the game special. Because it's quite a lot. We aren't going to go through here. I just want to hit the save. Which is right here. All right, folks, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, leave a comment. Comment is the one that I love the most. Thanks so much, and I will see you next time. Take care.